I've said it before out loud that uh, Kante is one of the, the greatest midfield players in, in the world. In the, the last few years, his performances are outstanding. One of the pleasures of me getting this job is that I'm allowed to able to work with players of that quality. So I think that NG and Golo fits into every manager's plans on the on the planet. I was uh, like uh, desperate to have him in any any in in, in my teams. Uh, he's a he's a Chelsea player and uh, he's a big Chelsea player and one of the best midfielders in the world. Golo Kante embodies uh, true personality and character because his personality and character uh, comes with a heavy dose of intelligence and humility. It's very, it's very special to be here because a uh, few years ago I was uh, in, uh, in France, in lower division. Uh, like five years ago I wasn't professional and uh, to be here with, uh, to receive this kind of award uh, with, uh, to join the list of uh, the, the biggest player uh, I couldn't imagine to be here. And I'm very, very impressed. I mean, I know him since many years and uh, we, we know him very well because we come from from French club. So we were very impressed from television. But to see the guy live, to see him, how he works, how humble he is and what quality he gives uh, to, to this team here is a, is a gift to be his coach and I'm, I'm super happy. When N'Golo arrived for the first time for training session in Minneapolis, in the United States and uh, trained for the first time. Of course, we knew how good he was and all top players can attest to this. Everybody knew how good N'Golo was, that's why we signed him. Uh, but after the training session, all the superstars at Chelsea Football Club gravitated towards him to give him a hug and a wonderful welcome. It is a testimony to a recognition of his wonderful talent. N'Golo for us uh, is not just an important uh, player. He's a determinant player for us, so I'm really very happy with the new contract. I'm really very pleased uh, for him, and uh, it's a very important uh, news, I think. I hear a lot of praise from, uh, from Michael, from everyone, but uh, he's, not on me. he's not only me, I owe so much to my teammates. He made uh, 50 passes, and... Uh, uh, he made uh, five mistakes. He has to improve in this. He has to improve. Yeah. No, but <laughs> <laughs> we knew then that we got lucky, and I sent flowers to Leicester Football Club <laughs> for letting us have it. I'm joking. I'm joking. Yes, but <laughs> yes, this that yeah and. Uh, uh, I have to find uh, one situation to, to tell him to improve. I owe also a big amount to my, to my family and my friends for their support because they, they show faith on me since the beginning and I want to thank also my, uh, my teammates, my manager, my coach from the previous club because uh, with them, season after season, they, they raised me up and uh, I... Uh, is the reason that's why I'm here today. I have a mental test for you about N'Golo. I want you to see if you can remember a sliding tackle from him. Yes, he doesn't slide tackle because he's intelligent. He gets in position, uh, he knows how to nick the ball away, uh, he anticipates uh, uh, intelligently, and that's what makes him great. Sometimes it's hard to believe when I, uh, when I, uh, I know where I was a few years ago, and uh, I really enjoy it, I appreciate to be here. If you come to our training ground in Cobham and you're not sure if he was there, all you have to do is walk around and, and look at the player's car park, and you will see the tiny little bit of car, and that will tell you that N'Golo is uh, in the building. He's still complaining about the uh, extravagant 500 pounds he spent on that car. I know that uh, David uh, told uh, something about uh, about him. He, he doesn't want to to pay the bill in the restaurant. <laughs> One of the big issues for the fans, at least, was Ngolo Kante.
Conte's position. Do you have any idea where you'll play? Yeah, I do, thankfully. <laughs> <laughs> it's special because uh, I couldn't say uh, I'm the best player, but uh, to be here, it's a really huge honor. There's so much I can say about N'Golo Kante tonight. Um, but I've been allotted only three minutes, <laughs> and it's not enough. But I want to express the great pride um, that I personally have for him and, and our football club uh, to be able to say that this wonderful player, this wonderful person, uh, is a part of our organization. I feel very good in England, in London also. And uh, yeah, uh, I hope the future is going to be very good also for, for me. Yeah.